For many years, Iran and Russia have been renowned for possessing the largest and most varied missile arsenal in the world. Their hypersonic missiles, capable of flying faster than five times the speed of sound, are considered unstoppable by most experts. But there is one country that is not moved by their threats, Israel. Israel is one of the few nations that has the best air defense system in the world, capable of stopping an unstoppable missile. And now, Israel has revealed its own secret weapon, a hypersonic missile that shocked Iran, Russia, and even Hamas. This missile is said to be the fastest and most accurate missile ever developed by Israel. It can hit any target in the Middle East within minutes and evade any countermeasures. In this video, we'll check out how Israel has been able to achieve this and explore the implications it holds for the future of warfare. Concerns surrounding hypersonic weapons have been a topic of discussion for quite some time now. In response to Iran's efforts to develop various versions of long-range missiles, a renewed effort has been made to counter this potential threat. While specific details regarding these developments remain classified, forces within the Defense Ministry have indicated that the primary focus lies in assisting the local defense industry in enhancing early warning sensors and systems. These advancements are intended to effectively intercept long-range missiles, including those of the hypersonic variety. But what's the fuss about hypersonic weapons? In recent years, hypersonic weapons have become a hot topic in military circles around the world. These weapons are capable of flying faster, farther, and more unpredictably than conventional missiles, making them harder to detect and intercept by existing defense systems. But with Israel's military, the story is different. They have very powerful missiles that most countries' hypersonic weapons cannot stand a chance with. One such missile is the Arrow 3. This U.S.-Israeli-built missile defense interceptor was designed to defeat medium-range ballistic missiles and entered service in 2017. The missile uses a hit-to-kill warhead to engage targets in space and is the longest-range interceptor currently fielded with the Arrow weapon system. It complements the Arrow 2, which engages targets in the upper atmosphere. The Arrow 3 provides hypersonic capability and can defend a very large area, providing comprehensive defense of strategic sites and large populated areas. It can destroy long-range threats, including those carrying weapons of mass destruction, far away from the target. It operates as an exo-atmospheric air defense system with an operational range of 1,500 miles. This means it can leave Earth's atmosphere to destroy an incoming threat in space during the spaceflight portion of the threat's journey. Despite the maneuverability of hypersonic missiles with thrust vectoring capability, the kill vehicle of the Arrow 3 can switch directions dramatically to keep up with the directional changes of any threat. According to numerous Israeli experts, including Professor Yitzhak Ben Yisrael, former director of the Israeli administration for the development of weapons and technological infrastructure, and currently the chairman of the Israeli Space Agency, it is also possible that the Arrow 3 can serve as an anti-satellite weapon. On November 9, 2023, for the first time, the Arrow 3 successfully intercepted a Houthi missile heading from Yemen to the country's southernmost city of Ayla. This successful test demonstrated the effectiveness of Israel's missile defense system and its ability to protect its citizens from potential threats. Another hypersonic weapon is the Arrow 4, the hypersonic interceptor that's causing quite a stir. With the ability to take down hypersonic threats like cruise missiles and glide vehicles, this state-of-the-art weapon is a force to be reckoned with. But what led Israel to make this? The urgency to develop such a system became apparent after Iran boasted about its hypersonic missile test in November 2022. While the authenticity of Iran's claim is still up for debate, the potential threat it poses to Israel is undeniable. Especially because a missile launch from Iran could reach Israel in just four minutes. Arrow 4 is the successor to Arrow 3 and is currently in development. Israel, in collaboration with the United States, is working tirelessly to create a missile defense system that will replace the existing Arrow 2. The goal is to counter not only current threats, but also future ones, both within and beyond Earth's atmosphere. If successful, Arrow 4 will be the most advanced hypersonic defense system in the world, providing an unprecedented level of protection for Israel and its people. The Iron Dome. This mobile air defense system is designed to intercept and destroy short-range rockets and artillery shells fired from distances of 4 
four to 70 kilometers away. Its primary purpose is to safeguard Israel from militant groups like Hamas in Gaza. Iron Dome made its debut on March 27, 2011, and it wasted no time in proving its work. Within just one month, it successfully intercepted its first missile from Gaza. This impressive feat not only earned Iron Dome operational status, but also saved Israel from billions of dollars in damages. With the ability to operate day and night, under any weather conditions, and handle multiple threats simultaneously, Iron Dome is undoubtedly the star of Israel's air defense system. So, how does Iron Dome work? It relies on three main components working together seamlessly. First, there's the detection and tracking radar, which identifies incoming rockets and calculates their trajectory to determine if they pose a threat. Each Iron Dome system is armed with up to 80 interceptor missiles spread across four launchers and a total of 150 systems protecting the entire nation of Israel. Since its implementation, Iron Dome has been a game changer, intercepting over 1,200 rockets with an impressive 90% success rate. It has proven its worth time and time again, especially during conflicts with the mob. Without Iron Dome's swift response, Israel would have suffered far greater casualties, the Iron Bee. Developed by Israel, this cutting-edge technology uses lasers instead of rockets to intercept and destroy incoming threats. With Israel facing torrential rocket and missile attacks, and thousands of lives lost since early October, they just had to make a move. And it's not just rockets and missiles they have to worry about. The threat of unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, mortars, and swarms of mini UAVs has left Israel and other countries scrambling for a solution. So the Iron Beam was designed to complement the highly effective Iron Dome system, which is more suited for longer-range missiles. This new system is highly precise, with a speed of light attack that makes it nearly impossible for drones, mortars, missiles, or even fighter jets to evade. The manufacturer of the Iron Beam, Raphael Systems, claims that the system will be ready for some degree of use within the next year, so we could be witnessing the future of air defense sooner than we think. One of the most intriguing features of the Iron Beam is its high-energy laser beam, which is invisible to the human eye. You need special optics just to see it. This means that the system can operate anonymously, giving it a clear advantage over its predecessor, the Iron Dome. Compared to other air defense measures like David's Sling or the Patriot Missile System, which rely on missiles or rockets to counter aerial threats, the Iron Beam also takes safety to a whole new level. When a rocket or missile collides or explodes near another missile, rocket, mortar, or drone, there is shrapnel and wreckage that falls to the ground below. This can create a hazardous situation for people in the targeted area or even those below the interception point. But the Iron Beam cuts that hazard equation in half. How? Well, it's simple. The lack of shrapnel from the interception means that there is no additional wreckage created by enemy forces. Once the laser beam locks onto a target and destroys it, it dissipates into thin air. No mess, no fuss. Lastly, we have the Sky Sonic. Unveiled on June 14, 2023, this anti-hypersonic missile defense system is truly one of a kind. After three years of development, the Sky Sonic Interceptor Missile is ready to take center stage. This announcement couldn't have come at a better time, as just days earlier, Iran claimed to have developed a new hypersonic missile. Raphael wasted no time in asserting the superiority of their creation, stating that the Sky Sonic missile represents a major technological leap in hypersonic missile defense. So, what sets the Sky Sonic apart from other defense systems? Well, it's all about maneuverability and speed. Designed with exceptional agility and high-speed capabilities, this missile can effectively neutralize hypersonic threats with unmatched precision and stealth. Hypersonic missiles, which travel at speeds over five times that of sound, are no match for the Sky Sonic. You may be wondering how the Sky Sonic differs from other air defense systems. Most air defense systems operate up to an altitude of 20 kilometers, while anti-ballistic systems intercept targets outside of Earth's atmosphere, generally above 70 kilometers. The Sky Sonic, however, aims to intercept hypersonic threats within the 20 to 70 kilometer altitude range. This is a critical zone where incoming missiles often maneuver to avoid traditional air defenses. With the Sky Sonic in action, these maneuvering missiles won't stand a chance. This weapon is a game changer in the realm of missile defense.
providing a level of protection that was previously unimaginable. But who knows what other secret weapons Israel has up its sleeve? One thing's for sure, the world will be watching closely.